If you have any trouble at all getting up and down from the ground, then we want to do a version of the world's greatest stretch that's modified. So we want to grab a chair, we're going to use that as a prop. So what we don't want to do is try to come out of this stretch and extend in our back. So we, we're really looking out for that. So we're going to grab a chair, I'm going to go up against it now. I'm gonna get in this position. My back is in a neutral position still. My shoulders are down and I'm squeezing this back glute. So I really gotta squeeze this back glute and that'll loosen up this hip flexor right here. I'm maintaining this position and I'm holding it for 10 seconds. And when I come up out of it, I stay in neutral right here with my back. Stand all the way up and then I'll reach back with the other leg and I squeeze that back glute. I'm not allowing myself to come up into extension. That would be bad, so I'm allowing my chest to come down. You can put your, your arm on your leg right here, and I can squeeze it, but I'm just not going up into extension, and I'm not changing the angle of my back at all. I'm squeezing for 10 seconds holding that glute. We're gonna do three of them on each side, and you should be able to stay in neutral when you come up and out of it. But that's how we're gonna loosen up our hip flexors, loose getting some more hip mobility and really activate our glute if you can't fire your glute very well just look for one of our next videos we're going to talk about a hip hinge squat we got to start firing our glutes really well to protect our back so now you try it